connect with this Oh, ah, okay. So this button. will, this machine will wiggle back and forth with the weights on it until it finally comes apart. Yeah, here this is a button patch. Oh, okay. Yeah. This little machine is testing how exactly how many times you can press the button on your display. I wonder what it's up to. Ah, it won't show me. Oh, okay, there we go. I don't see a counter. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what. Yeah, I don't know. How do you use it? I don't know. It's all Greek to me, but rest assured, this thing has probably been sitting here all day. I don't know, probably getting the buttons pressed, maybe a month. Who knows? More testing equipment. Battery. Battery testing. Battery testing. Yeah. BMS. Ah, yeah. okay. Let's start the BMS battery packing business. Yeah. We had do some engineer design mm -hmm. and also BMS design and uh, yeah, something like this. We can this here and for our engineer team. Some, uh, uh, new ah, so new product testing. Yeah. That's why it's all got so many pieces to it because this is constantly changed to new products. Yeah. So looks like you're testing another one of the production mid drive yeah. units in here, and he's probably going through all the functions just like the other testing booth, making sure that this thing is working properly. Hopefully not right now. Yeah, <laughs> the software engineer want to add more function inside. Ah, yeah, okay. Very special uh, impairments. Ah. Yeah. Okay, this is the test. Later we can test. Later we can test. That sounds very good. Yeah. <laughs> so this is where you test out the bi the finished product on a bicycle going up the hill. Yeah. And if you can see that, they got the little degrees, a little protractor thing written up there. 10 degree incline this uh this might be the biggest hill in all of Sujo. <laughs> <laughs> and these are all the 15 oh 15 degrees going this way yeah. oh okay so yeah you, this one's much more steep you can see that the uh it doesn't go nearly as far so you got 15 degrees going up that way and it flattens out and then a much longer descent for 10 degrees going that way and there's lucky <laughs> it looks like you got a big track here to test out bikes anyway for the flat line all along here um, and not a whole lot of commotion here either I know that in a lot of places there's cars and scooters running around everywhere, but this is nice and quiet. There's not a lot of traffic here. If you talk about the test, we have a professional test team, as many as eight people doing tests uh, all day long. Everyone has to achieve 100 kilometers. They actually ride outside oh. every day. So you're going to see some of them, I believe. And, oh. and we've been doing that. Uh, for the last uh, five years already, I think. Oh, wow. And uh, there's no anyone else in this industry is doing that so constantly. And all our products need to be tested by people. So they're not all, so if I understand right, your products are not only tested when you get the materials, they're tested throughout the production. They're tested before they get sent out and you have real road tests Absolutely. constantly every day of of your products exactly exactly yes 